hello welcome to my channel this is rejoice and today we're gonna do the flower bead we did last time this one is what you're gonna do we're gonna do the flower flow with it how you're doing i hope you guys are all doing good in this quarantine you know by the grace i'm good this is what you're gonna do today isn't this beautiful mm. and i'm in the air for you know about thing it? it's very easy to do and as you can see we already did our flowers so we're gonna need the beads we have our size eight size six pearls two different colors our glue our scissors of course flip flop and our measurement tape so let's start with what you're gonna do today okay it's very easy pick two yellow color and two blue color we, since we're using two different colors so any color of your choice is what you choose this is what we have make a knot go ahead and make a knot like two or two knot or three and go to your beads we're doing right angle with as you can see i'm going to my beads come out from any one of the choice you can come from the blue or the yellow this is what we have i'm coming out of the yellow as you can see from the yellow pick one yellow and two blue this is what we have Come to the opposite side of where your thread is coming out from. Pull. You can see our shape is coming. Go up to the top one. Be blue. Sorry, my thumb. My camera is bored. I'm trying to zoom it, and my camera keeps changing. Okay. Sorry about that. So pick one blue. And two yellow. Like this. Come back to the opposite where this came out from. This one, yeah. Go in here and pull your thread. Okay, we have our three boxes now. We only one three boxes. Now we have our three boxes. So moving to the next one. We are not adding. We're gonna add, but we know we only need three boxes. So you have to come back to the opposite side and come out from the yellow on your right. This is what you should have now. As you can see I picked one yellow and two blue. You see? It's adding up. So let's go back into the yellow. We pick one, one yellow and one blue. Go down over here. Then go up. Come out to the, from the yellow. Go back into your blue. And the yellow on the bottom. This is what you should have. Pull your work. Now pick one yellow and one blue. 
and go into the blue on your top this is what you should be doing go into your yellow this is what you should have as you are doing then you will look you the shape itself will be coming up so you will know what you should have Now we're going to start on that box again. So we pick two yellow and one blue. It's very easy. While you are doing it you yourself, you know how to do it. The shape will start popping up. You can choose to use one color of your choice. I just want to use two colors. So it's up to you. And we'll be doing this to you. You should you too. You have like 26 or 25 boxes. You can see the shape. It will depend the length that you that you want. That's the length that I want anyway. This time I picked two blue because of where I'm coming out from. I need to pick two blue. Go up again. We pick two yellow over here. This is what you should have, as you can see. We have three boxes, and like I said, you need like 26 of it. So I have my flip flop, and go ahead and do it. I'll finish with mine. This is what you should have. Let's count how many boxes do we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six. Like I said, twenty six boxes is what you need. Now let's go ahead and cut our flip flop. You can leave like an inch or half an inch length and cut it. Cut this side too. And then any of your any one you can choose to cut it from any one either the left or the right. I will suggest you measure like two inches, two or three or four. It will depend. I took like three inches from it because my feet is big. <laughs> I have a big feet. I choose to do like four inches out from it now we're going to connect these two together so get your go ahead and get a trade make a knot on the top like this go in there be careful with your needle I've been poking myself all day anyway. I make a knot at the top, so that's why my thread was able to stick. Now go in here too. We're going to rock this summer. Whether coronavirus or COVID-19, we're still going to rock with our flip flop at the park or the beach. Make a knot at the top. You can go ahead and make a knot or just go in again. going to the other side again I believe everyone is okay please take good care of yourself out there 
you know, like they said, social distance that will keep us safe. So please go ahead. I don't know about you, but everybody's wearing masks these days. If it's okay for you, you can go ahead and wear your masks. But me, I can't breathe in that mask, man. I can't breathe in. It's difficult for me to breathe in the mask, but what can I say? I still have to wear it if I'm going to the store. So go ahead. Connect it like three or four times. Then when you finish, you add your glue in there to make it more secure. Make a knot. There you go. So I have my you can use the E6000 or 7000 glue. Put it between the where you put your thread, like where you tie them up. Put the glue in between there to make it more secure. This glue is very good, believe me. Let it dry like two or three minutes before you start sewing. Then cut your thread off. Okay, I did. So I'm going to go ahead and sew. You know, we already know how to sew. So we are sewing with the middle bead. Since we have three boxes, we are using the middle bead to sew. So go ahead and start sewing. You already know what to do. We'll be doing this like so. You know how to sew already. Go ahead and sew it. This is why it's not hate of sewing. When you're ready with your bead and you're about to sew on the flip flop, then you keep moving, you know. But we'll get it done. We'll get it done. We use the middle one to sew, like I said. This is what we should have. It's okay with you you can use one color to do your netting over here but go ahead and sew and use the middle middle one so i finish with it with my sewing this is what i have and i'm back to put our flower over there and we will need size 14 bead so go in the flip flop I already have my needle thread on. We're going to put our flower over there. This is very easy. And always remember, you go from the top to the bottom. Don't go from the bottom. If you go from the bottom, if you have the knot on it, it will be scratching your feet, so your toes. So go from the top so that the, the knot will be at the top to be, be on your body. You see, so I went in there and I came out. 
Now I'm going to start sewing. Put your flower over there. Go into your flower. Now pick your size 14 bead. You can use 14 or 16, any one of your choice. It's supposed to be big anyway, so 14 or 16. It's okay. This is what you have. Then you go into the other side. Remember, we are trying to make our flower stick over there. So you are coming from the right side with me, from my right side, I'm going to my left side. Just as you can see what I'm doing. Then pull. This is what you should have. Mm. Go back in there and make it secure, you know. Sew inside like two or three times. But like this two is okay. But I believe I believe you should do it like two or three times to make it more secure. For the, it doesn't matter where you come out from, any, you can choose any bead. You are just trying to secure your work over here, so it doesn't matter which bead that you pick. Mm. Go with him two or three times. Say, Oh, Benetta. So I went in like three, two or three times. And I think it's okay now. Just gonna go into my 14 bead and come out from any bead of my choice. I'm gonna start connecting to our next step. And we're gonna start using the size eight. We use size 8 and size 6. So I think it's secure enough too. For me, it's secure enough. So find a way and come out from your white bead. From any on top of the white, on the white, white beads, which is size 8. This, this, this law is secure. This is what you should have. You can leave it like this too to work. You can wear it like this. That's up to you. Or you can connect it like the way I connect it. So I'm trying to come out from any of my bead. Go in there. Go maybe if you can go into your blue, your blue base and come out from your white bead on top. The size eight white bead. You know one. 
okay i got one so pick your eight and your six and your eight this is what you should have go back opposite where your thread is coming out from we are doing exactly what we did on the base the blue and yellow what you did but this time it's very easy like you know right angle with like you can see i think we're picking yeah so you go ahead and pick and then you count on the bottom one on your six in a six bead is where you connect So go ahead. Go ahead. So keep sewing, got your blue and your yellow. Our yellow is in our, we're going to use it at our midi bead. So I'm done. I have my six box. And I'm going to use my light bit one to connect. So pick one blue, count to the six, three, four, five, six. So last one, last one. I'm using that to connect. With this, it doesn't matter you, you, you do the same thing I'm doing. That's the length I want. You can choose the length that you want. You can choose to pick only five or six. It will depend how your feet is, you know, how big, what size you're doing. I'm using size 11. That's why I make it big. So go through it again to make it secure. Secure your work. We are done. Now go in again. going to like two or three times then you make a knot so I'm gonna go ahead and make my knot right now Go ahead and make your knot. You can do it on the base or you can do it over here. That's okay. But remember, wherever you make your knot, don't cut the thread right away. Just go through some bead before you cut your thread. I make my knot here. I'm going to go into the sum of the bead then I cut my thread. Well, work your way inside there. Work your way. Low cable thing inside. Car car to trade it. No care or fee no te o mo poor work. Just put it more inside for me. Oh secure work. Okay, I think I'm okay now. I can go ahead and cut one trade. Why no folk man be any? It's okay to go on your folk man.
Mbina. Please remember to subscribe to my channel, please. And share. Like, please. If you need to, you don't understand, please let me know. One green work and I be just me go go out head me put it into more bead. She's okay. You can you you don't have to go through a lot of beads like like what I'm doing. Just go ahead and cut your thread. We're done. This what we have. Hmm. When I've been here for. This what we have. It's easy and beautiful. Everyone can do it, please. Subscribe to my channel. I'm begging you. This is the flower we did. Subscribe to my channel. Share with your friends and tell them to subscribe too. Anything you understand, please. Don't forget, Jesus loves you. In this quarantine, Jehovah God will see it's true. Stay blessed and remember, always wash your hands. Know that God is with you. Bye-bye for now. Love you.